Ladies, ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. Um, today I would like to talk about on the well running Cortex fatigue of high power AC locomotives running in complicated environments. I'm going to give this talk in four parts. Now I will give a research background. The research focuses on the well uh, RCF of high power AC locomotives running in you know it's China. The concern locomotive are uh, called actual arrangement here. It's maximum power at design speed uh, 7,200 kilowatt at 120 km power respectively. Over 1,300 locomotives performed very well in most bureau. However, in total 40 locomotives uh, uh, of this type are equipped in one bureau at a sphere where RC was observed. These 40 locomotives run in complicated environments such as sharp curves, steep and undulating slopes. RCF typically occurs around the NRC of a wheel. Under certain conditions, a crack of the RCF may propagate downward into a depth up to 50 millimeters. Considering the importance of material defects on RCF initiation, the wheel material had been first examined in laboratory. It was found that the real material meets the requirements of status, that is, material defects should not be the cause of the RCF. <laughs> Besides the material, be, beside material defects, other factors influence RCF have also been intensively studied. Therefore, a research project was launched in 2016 to study the initiation mechanism of the RCF on the basis of field observation and monetary testing. Sorry? Oh. In the first time, 50 locomotives were observed and mirrored, based on which 80 typical locomotives were, were selected for phase monetary testing, lasting for 18.5 months. It was found that RCF occurs continuously along the circumform and is located in a zone about 30 millimeters wide set at NRC. The cracks are angles of minus 30 degrees to 30 degrees to the axis, and the pitting is often visible. Obviously, the RCF belongs to the third-class RCF by deals. Based, based on the real reprofiling of all 40, 40 locomotives, the reprofiling period is taken as a, uh, overseas, the cutting amount is taken as a ordinary. It can be seen that. The rate of filing period is as low as 18,000 km and is 71,000 km on average. The corresponding to 4 to 5 months running. The counting amount is 2 to 50 mm deep. Corresponding the axis of where RCF was allocated. The result shows that the, 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 the RCF was allocated in, in axis 1, 3, Four and six. <laughs> Moreover, no correlation are found between specific things at the uh, at the, at the operation uh, operation density. <laughs> These forty locomotives with sphere RCF mostly running complicated tire to dart line. The total length of the line is six hundred and fifty uh, seventy meter back and forth. The minimum radius is two hundred and fifty meter. The the section with radii eye of ready eye ready the form two hundred fifty meter and two eighty hundred meter are about ninety nine kilometer long in total. Uh, the maximum slope is two point four four percent. The sections with uh, with slopes ready the form uh, minus one point two percent to minus two point four percent are about fifty uh, six kilometer long in total. Uh, typical, typical real profiles mirrored on another similar line. Mirrors on Tiato Da line was not arranged due to many difficulties. Obviously, running condition on this side is very harsh. <laughs> In order to reduce the RCF to try counter mirrors, namely side check at TCMS update was had been applied. Side check was applied to all 80 monitored locomotives. The table shows that uh, the, uh, the, the uh, aluminum and ferric oxide of the other side are much higher than of the new side. 
the new set is almost purely silicon. TCMS update was only applied uh, five locomotives. The intention of TCMS update uh, is uh, to reduce the long longitudinal impact suffered by the locomotive and uh, to increase uh, the smoothness in operations. TCMS update was only applied uh, five locomotives. After the counter mirrors, the rapid filing period is two to three times longer than before. Moreover, three locomotives with, uh, without a TCMS update also showed a similar improvement, suggesting the dominant role of sand on the RCF. Consequently, the, rep of, uh, the dominant factor of, re of well rep filing shift from RCF to the RCF as a flat well. This table, uh, this table indicates uh, the rep, of, the rep filing operations of, uh, of AT locomotives caused by the RCF after mirrors. It can be seen, be seen that RCF wheels are still on axles 1, 3, 4, and 6, and the cutting amount is 6 to 10.5 mm steep. <laughs> Obviously, the RCF problem was not solved, solved completely by the mirror side, but the current rate was reduced significantly, which can be drawn from, uh, from the fact that uh, the number of rapid filing operations of 40 of locomotives caused by the RCF dropped from 82 in 2015 to 30 in 2017. Uh, comparing comparing typical, typical, uh, typical trade picture with RCF to, the, to this before the, before the mirrors, it can be seen that uh, the pitting has been greatly reduced, but the level crack remains similar. In a conclusion, set plays an important role in RCF initiation, but it's probably not the only cause. In, in order to explain the RCF initiation of the mirrors, we will use numerical simulation. A multiple dynamic model has been established. Uh, <laughs> um, a, a, tra a trailer and a locomotive are connected with, with a couple in between. You, uh, uh, a train usually consists of 18, uh, uh, 18 trailers and a, a locomotive. The resistance of, uh, of the race 17 trailers is applied at the, at the end of uh, the first trailer. The vertical attention contact are used, are used to hertz as an approach model. RCF production are, uh, uh, RCF prediction are conducted using shift map as a TGAM model. Uh, typical one profiles of wheel as real mirror are used for simulations. <laughs> mm. the, the combination of speed and a slope as a time track and a curve track uh, used in simulated cases are uh, shown uh, show in this picture as examples. The speed is assumed to be constant uh, and uh, it, its, value based, its value based on the actual running condition of the to dot line. As the first actor leader the train and the right curves are always assumed in every case. This table indicates the wheel damage function running on the time track with different slopes. <laughs> the, post the positive and the negative damage represent uh, RCF and the wheel respectively. Note that only the, uh, only the RCF CF resulted in level crack is included in this figure. The, the slope is, uh, is represented by the eye. Uh, results of positive and negative slopes are plotted in the same figure for comparison. It has been said, said RCF is expected on the road set at an RC if running on time tracks with negative slopes. Further, RCF then roughly increases to 1.5 to 2 times as the absolute value of the negative slope increases by 0.4%. The significance of slopes on RCF initiation can also be seen from the, uh, shake, the prediction of shakedown map. That is, the larger slope is, the most people are in the plastic shakedown or rushing those. <laughs> this picture indicates uh, 
the, the damage distribution of the wheels of the first bogey when the locomotive run on a curve with different slopes. It can be seen, be seen that uh, the, the, the wheel number three L may initiate, initiate the RCF. That is, uh, for the absolute value of the maximum damage, the RCF damage is larger than the wear damage. <laughs> this table indicates the, the shakedown map of, of wheel number three, wheel number three L running on curves. It's consistent with the, the result of the Qigang model. The maximum damage of wheel number three L uh, running, on curve, running on curves uh, is compared with the tiny track uh, on the same slopes. Uh, so the result shows that uh, the RCF on curves is over 18 times larger than the tiny track uh, on the same slopes. Uh. <laughs> More simulations show that uh, when, the when the red eye of curves, curves are less than that to kilometer, the wheel damage is affected by curves at negative slopes. Uh. When the red eye of curves uh, are more than to, to uh, more than two kilometers, the wheel damage is only affected by negative slopes. Curves with negative slopes have the biggest influence on RCF initiation, followed by the tiny track with negative slopes as the plan curves, which is related with the uh, complicated running environments. RCF, RCF wheels running on curves with, with, negative, with negative slopes uh, are recorded in, in this table, which can be explain the uh, RCF initiation of Agatha preference. In a conclusion, RCF wheels of high power AC locomotives are made on axles number one, three, four, and six, independent of wheel material and specific seasons. RCF is affected by the set as a complicated running environment. Before countermeasures, typical damage appear a preference of your tread is a left crack with a, pit, with a pitting. After the set was replaced, the reprofiling period is two to three times longer than before. But RCF still exists and is affected by the complicated running environment. The typical damage appearance of your tread is only left letter cracks. The biggest influence of the running uh, environments on RCF is the curves with negative slopes, uh, followed by the time track with negative slopes at the plaque curves. Uh. RCF of uh, the preference is caused by, by curves, uh, is especially with negative slopes. Uh. Thank you for your attention. <laughs>